There will not be many people who have not seen Santa Claus. We all have seen Santa distributing gifts in the streets and dancing in the streets. But, do we know who is the real Santa Claus? More Nikolovos is the true personality behind the story of Santa Claus or Papa Noel who leaves presents for children on Christmas Eve. He was the Bishop of Myra, under the Apostolic See of Antioch. He was born in Patara and Lycia, in modern Turkey, a province of Asia Minor. When he grew up, he adopted the ascetic way of life, and went on a pilgrimage to Palestine to visit the holy places. He eventually became the Bishop of Myra, which was an Episcopal See under the jurisdiction of the Holy See of Antioch. During the rule of Emperor Diocletian, Nicholas faced great persecution, torture and imprisonment. He was finally freed by Constantine. He, he was among the 318 Holy Fathers at the Council of Nicaea in 325 AD. Saint Nicholas was keen to help the poor and the needy. The most famous story tells of a poor man with three daughters. In those days, a young woman's father had to offer prospective husbands a dowry. The larger the dowry, the better the chance a young woman would find a good husband. Without a dowry, a woman was unlikely to marry. Without dowries, this poor man's daughters were therefore destined to be sold into slavery. Mysteriously, on three different occasions, a bag of gold appeared in their home, providing the needed dowry. On finding out it was Nicholas who provided the money, the man bowed down at his feet, paid him great homage, and thanked him for saving his daughters. The saint refused to accept any thanks and asked them to thank the Lord who put this thought in his heart. Over the centuries, his legend evolved into the custom of gift-giving on the saint's feast. In English-speaking countries, Saint Nicholas became Santa Claus further expanding the example of generosity portrayed by this holy man. <laughs>